Hello guys and welcome back to Onion Gameplay and today we're going to be doing another one-off. Yes, I said correctly, another one-off. And this time we're going to be playing a game called 44 Party. Wait, what's 44 Party? You'll have to see and we'll find out. It's loading right now. <laughs> that same problem again that's happened with Party Carnival. Oh, let's set this to intimacy. Start game. <laughs> Who next? Same people behind uh, the party carnival, which we did a playthrough of. We did two rounds of. Of course, we do plan on doing round three of it. This is 44 Party. We can't even go to party mode. Basically what 44 Party is, it's also called the Party Game in Japan. This is actually the predecessor to Party Carnival. Oh, we, it looks like we can only do one player. And who do I want to be? I'm gonna be the answer. So, does that we can't play? Unfortunately. We got a couple games to try out, so why not? Penalty game. Do it again! Run us back to the tell screen? Let's do the actual party games. Hit the penguin. Move the hammer with the directional button or with the left analog stick and hit penguins with the X button. Alright. Ready? Go! I can definitely tell they don't have voices compared to uh, Party Carnival. I also find Party Carnival will look to be a little better. I guarantee you this is not going to be that long compared to like Party Carnival since it's only a few mini games. Slide puzzles.
Gosh dang. This is gonna be tricky. Oh no. Can't even solve this. I can guarantee you the characters look different compared to uh, Party Carnival. Let's do balloon pop. Hundred millimeter base, essentially. Uh, run by toggling the circle and X buttons rapidly. Simply just going to be a one off. Right, let's do the obstacle race. This game requires the analog controller. Clear the hurdles with the X button. Jump with the jump in the jump height and length vary depending on the strength with the square button pressed. This is not even going to be that fun. Let's do target practice. Okay, move the sights with directional button or with the left analog stick and fire with the X button. The closer you get to the target, the higher the score. I think the only way to climb multiplayer with emulation on this for this game is if we do a net play. If we do a net play server. I think this is going to be a short one, so, uh, because it's not going to be that long. Thank you. Because some of the other events I have. Uh, hold on a second, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Now let's continue. Let's do the clumsy game. Fire as an analog controller.
wait. I like how the neighbor just killers and that's it. I'm pretty much getting bored of this, so why not do one more? This is probably the shortest we've ever done for this series so far. Alright. Let's do the hammer. I'm pretty much getting bored of this at this point, so. Let's try this again. Oh! Okay. Pretty much getting bored of this game at this point. So yeah, that was 44 party. We couldn't do the party mode because it's locked to like multiplayer. So this is why it's only a one-off. And this is why this video is incredibly short. So yeah. We probably are not gonna do a ra any rounds of this game because uh, we can't do mo the party mode. So yeah. What? So we couldn't, we can't do anything to make up for that. So anyways, pretty much we're going to end this video right here. So, uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you like this video and subscribe, give it a big thumbs up. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Engine Gameplay. So we'll see you guys next time.